Hey everyone, so you should have a skateboard uh, paper like this. It's beige, if you move, it kind of makes a crinkly sign like this, but it probably doesn't have a curved edge. So if you're trying to figure out the curved edge, you go ahead, you go to the middle. I think if I were to divide it in two, that would probably be the midpoint. And then you curve the top and the bottom like so, and you make a little curved line kind of going down to the bottom and then it gets smooth and straight. It does not need to be perfect. Do not obsess about it. Now, if you don't have uh, scissors, right, for whatever reason, you could go ahead and you can just shade the background like that, you know, or you could do that better yet with your marker. I'm not gonna use the marker on here because I'm worried about ruining this particular table. Okay, but you can kind of shade the background, then you have a curved edge to work with. Okay, same with the opposite side. So just to review, you go from the midpoint, and then as you approach the side, you curve down. Okay, go from the midpoint, as you approach the side, you curve down. I'm gonna go ahead, I'm gonna shade the background, just in case I don't have scissors, for whatever reason. And there you have it. And then you have your paper. Oops, I'm throwing on the table. Awesome. For whatever reason, you go ahead and you have this, right? And then it's beautiful, right? And then you do your skateboard in this. I'll kind of zoom out so you can see. This is a big space to work in. Now, voila, you went and you found scissors somewhere in your house, somewhere in your apartment. And great, you asked someone and you're gonna go ahead, you're gonna use those and you just kind of curve the edges, follow along the line that you made. Oh no, it's like not perfect. I am not gonna freak out. Okay, curve to the side. Beautiful, voila! And then you go up here, curve up. Okay, maybe I'll curve this a little bit more. You know, I like, be like, okay, is it equal on both sides? Let's see and then curve down okay and then there you have it it should really like end at the same point it's a little lopsided that's okay you can like fix it but you don't want to obsess about it you want to go ahead you want to get started so again you know maybe do a light area for where your focal point is going to be right and then think how am i going to keep it visually balanced like what am i going to have here what am i going to have here it could be anything you want you want the color scheme to be unified you want to be using dark and light values and you just want to keep going and think about how am I going to create movement all throughout the board. Okay, so go ahead, get started. Start to do light pencil work in the next couple of days. We're going to start adding color midweek. Okay, if you need feedback, come to office hours.